What's up guys? I'm Eric Adler. I'm a pitcher here. What's up guys? Brock Woken, third baseman. This is the couch. Let's take a tour of our facilities. This is the entrance to the Chris Hurd Player Development Center. As you walk through the player entrance, first thing you see, you got the Deeks and the Pros. Most recently, shout out Gavin Sheets. Um, you got another first rounder, Matt Antonelli right here. Shout out my boy Shane Munts, Arizona Diamondbacks. That's where we strive to be every day. Let's take a deeper look at our clubhouse. As we come in here, we got our Demon Deacon captains. These are the guys that really show for the program and everybody tries to be like them. They're, they're true deeks. They have dedication, energy, attitude, confidence, selflessness. So we like to see them every day as we get into our work. Alrighty, so we got our training room. If you need anything, really, any bump, scratch, mark, don't matter. Strom's the guy for it. On this wall right here, it says live your legacy. Development side, our coaches, they put this here on purpose, you know, as you're walking to and from the locker room and the player lounge, live your legacy. All right, so this is the player lounge. This is where we all hang out before, after practice, off day, whatever it may be. Um, you come in here, you got all the snacks you need. Go in there, mini sandwich stuff, whatever it may be. This is our biggest recruiting tool right here, the chocolate milk machine. Um, this honestly is the most important thing we have in here. Get your calories, chocolate milk is just busting, busting. So it's very good. Coffee machine, come over here, any snacks, and then the Gatorade machine. Now on the other half, it's probably a better half. Um, you know, you got so many flash screens, you, you see them all over the place, can't even count. Um, you got an Xbox, PS5. Uh, you got some tables, do some homework if you feel like it. Ping pong table, which I personally run. Um, you got foosball table over there. You got two Synergy computers to uh, really, you know, access your development anytime you need it. Now let's take a look at our clubhouse. This is our locker room. Uh, it's pretty special. You know, you got Wake Forest over top of you. You got our mottos, dedication, energy, attitude, confidence, selflessness. That's what it means to be a deek. Um, all these numbers are in numerical order. So we got zero all the way around to our last guy, number 51. Here we got Brock's locker. If you want to take a gander and judge him a little bit, you can. Um, and then he's a West Coast guy. West is best, man. But I don't know about that, but I'm an East Coast guy. These are the lower numbers, so it goes from number two over. And we've been the best side for the past three years, all day. And actually, I got a little picture up here of me and Brock. And that we cute. Went on one of our little retreats, so. That's pretty nice. We got this little pitch logic thing right here. It's a little baseball that you can track all the numbers, induce bird, all, you name it, just like track man, but all of it's in a ball. It's like a little spaceship baseball. It's kind of impressive. Um, but then you come up here, got TVs for film. Well, Billy will come in here and put whoever we're facing, whatever pitcher, and then here's a get after it and study it and then we'll go out and dominate. All right, now you see the locker room where we bond. Let's take a look at the equipment area right here. Um, you got you, you got your three shoots, um, one for your uniforms, one for your towels after you shower, and then um, the other one's for your loops after you know a long day at practice. Um, come over here, our amazing equipment guy, Tony. Um, he'll, he'll wash it, he'll put it in here, you got a combination. You open it up, get your stuff, get ready for practice. And here we got the pleasure of actually seeing Tony Joyce, the one and only. How are you? Let me just shake your hand on camera. This guy is the heartbeat of Deacon Baseball. All right, so now we'll come in here, look at the bathroom, personally my favorite place. Um, you got nice four sinks, nice mirrors. Got 15 shower heads, I think. And if you come in here, the best shower, the handicap shower, it's got a little handle that's separate too. I'm a huge shower guy. Those that are close to me know that. Um, so that's the place to be. And then you come in here, got some urinals, some toilets, you know, not really pretty stuff, but you got the mud room. This is where we clean up our cleats, all the catcher stuff right here. Um, we got scrubby bubbies over there. That's what I like to call them. Um, get your cleats right before game day, what you call it. Come over here, helmets, bats, whatnot. And then this is where Strom hydrates us with the coolest of H2Os. And then we get ready to go. Come out here, you get the wall of champions, you know, everything ranging from our national championship team to AC championship teams, some we strive to be for every day. 
A nice year in the World Champions. Um, you got some more NCAA appearances ranging back from you know 1949 to a recent one, 2017. Uh, you shot to the Super Regional teams, teams that hosted regional here that ended up going to a Super. Um, then you know you, you come up like up here. You got the first step to Omaha, something we something we really cherish here. Um, we really believe in it. After you've crossed these doors, it's time to play. So this is the entrance to the field. You know we got team first. Dedication right here, constant reminders of what it takes to be a deke. So this is where you walk into the dugout. Yeah, you got your Gatorade station over here, Stromer. Our uh, trainer, he's the best in the business, you know. He gets us really taken care of, stay hydrated. Come all the way down to the end of the dugout. You got your bat rack. Uh, it's mainly for position players. You got your helmets, batting gloves, leg guards, whatever you need. Um, our position guys put our hats up here, hats and gloves, so we can pick each other up after the inning. Got your bat rack down there, first steps to the field get it. And my favorite part is the first steps out onto the field. We got the great David F. Couch ballpark. Um, got the diamond suite, all the Deke alumni cheering you on. And then you walk up to the mound. Once you cross over this line, never step on the line. Um, it's game time for sure. Um, there's not, no better feeling than pitching on this mound in front of your buddies and in front of your family, all that stuff. Um, it's truly a special place. Now we're going to take a look at our weight training facility and our batting cage. My favorite Mandy here at Wake Forest, this is where, this is where we get after it. This is where we uh, have our great strength coach, Mark Siever. He's the man. Anything you need strength-wise, mobility-wise, he can do it for you. Um, you know, you got the dumbbells over there. You got the racks right here. You got the uh, movable, movable dumbbells, switching weights. Um, you got med balls. Um, jump ropes, kettlebells, bands, anything and everything, we got it. Now we'll show you outside our turf area where we get some sprints, some sled pushes. This is our hitting facility out behind left center. Let's take a look inside. Over here, we got our Dynavision. This is a little game we like to play with each other, a little competition, three action thing. These light up, you press the buttons. You got two long cages, um, you got two hack attacks in each cage uh, for whatever you want, spin, velo, whatever you got, we, we have it. Um, you got the hit tracks over here. When it's working, it's awesome. Tells you ball flight, exit velocity, all that good stuff. Come over here. We got any tool that you want, we have it. You got ax bats, heavy bats, light bats, one-handed bats. You got PVC pipes, med balls, connection balls. Anything you want, we got it. All right, we got our outfield entrance right here. Just so happens to be the spot where Derek Crum made a diving catch right there in that corner. Crum races back, dives and makes the catch. What a play by the freshman Derek Crum. All of our fans were going crazy, you know, packing the house, it's always great. And it's a cool vantage point out here. You know, not many people get to see this, um, but I think it's a great view. You know, you got the football stadium over there. The Chris Hurd Player Development Center up there, the couch, and then the massive screen over there. So this is our bullpen. Um, this is where we get ready to play. You know, the starting pitch will be throwing. The whole rest of the guys will be right there cheering them on. We got fans up here that'll be heckling sometimes or just cheering you on and whatnot. Um, but what, once you get in here, you know it's time to go. All right, now that we've seen outside in our stadium, Let's go into one of the most impressive things we have here at Wake, the pitching lab. We'll start with the track man right here. That's just a small part of the analytic side of things. Um, everyone knows about track man and tracks, ball flight, spin, axis angle, all that good stuff. We got this, go straight out here. We got more mounds out there, the bullpen area. And then you come to the mound that's got pressure plates here that can read your ankle movement, your strength, how your ankle's causing problems with your elbow, et cetera. And then if you look up top, I think we got 16 cameras, maybe, probably more, I don't know. Uh, but these really gather anything you could think of about baseball. And then we got three flat screens that will give you instant feedback about what you're doing in each pitch, where your axis is, how this cutter's moving differently than your fastball, you name it, it can do it. Yeah, I mean, this is really a, uh, a special thing to have as a pitcher, you know, having everything 
you could dream of to analyze your pitching and make you a better pitcher for the future. Um, it really gives us a leg up on our competition. This is a Crawford family meeting room right here. Uh, we come in here every day, meet every day for practice, 30, 45 minutes. Uh, you know, we got two TVs, um, a drop down flash screen to really go over our practice plan, to conquer the day. It's a really, really helpful tool. So this is our lobby area. It's got all the historical achievements, you know, gold gloves, ACC trophies, the 1955 ring. Um, and then we got the patio overlooking the bit, uh, football stadium. This is pretty cool. You know, you don't really got to go to the game. You can literally just watch it from here, but you got the massive uh, scoreboard blocking your vision a little bit. Come over this way. Um, you know, you got, you got this wall right here. Um, it's a little screw off ball and all our alumni come back and sign one each year. Um, me and Eric come up, sign one after you graduate one day. Um, leading up this way, you got the wall of the All-Americans. Um, you know, every single American, first, second, and third team that have been ran, ran through this program. Um, and now let's take a look at the Diamond Suite. All right, this is the Diamond Suite. This is where all the alumni come to watch some games. Uh, here you got the Ron and Linda Wellman Lifetime Teammate Award. Um, pretty much just being there for the Deeks no matter what. Um, you come over here, you got a great view of the game. You know, you can chirp anybody from this distance you can do whatever you like got tvs to cover if you want to watch online too or just another game whatever it may be and if you come over this way we got the first pitch guest speakers some of these guys you might have heard of them um cal ripkin jr john smoltz jim abbott joe girardi uh, these guys are people that have a great impact on our team um, and what i can't forget about is these plush seats my man Brock is demonstrating that for you it doesn't get much better than that if you're watching a baseball game watching the Deeks dominate on somebody you got the most comfy chair to do it in right here now let's take a look at our video room it's really important for our development position player and pitcher wise it's pretty huge you got two synergy computers displayed on four flash screen TVs to make one huge viewing screen um, you know, this is where we come in individually or as a team to really dominate our film. And, uh, you know, time to go find out where my partner in crime went. I mean, Eric! Oh, what's up, man? Nice oh, to see you. Oh, what's going on? Nice Welcome to my office. Nice to see you. How are you? I'm doing all right. It's good. It's good. Let me take you around. This is the boss man's home. Um, I'm not going to lie, as a freshman sitting in these chairs or those chairs talking to him, it's pretty nervous. Pretty intimidating. Um, I mean, this is pretty legit stuff not a bad office got a nice flat screen behind him and he's got the most important quote that we uh, talk about and it's I've learned that people will forget what you said people will forget what you did but people will never forget how you made them feel um, it's deeper than just baseball players here uh, we try to build you up as a person and this guy right here knows how to do it best That ends our facility tour. Thanks for joining us. See you later, guys. Go Deeks.